this is Adria and today I'm going to show you how you can back up your entire Firefox profile including your bookmarks, your browsing history, your extensions and all that when Firefox starts to act up. So Firefox is a great browser, it's secure, it's way better than Internet Explorer but sometimes it has problems and when it has problems one of the things Mozilla will tell you to do is to create a new profile. Now if you've installed a bunch of extensions then obviously you don't want to go ahead and you know um, add them all back in and that's going to take a lot of time, right? So um, what you can do is use this really cool utility there's, Fire, there's Firefox add-ons and it's called FEBE so we're going to go ahead and type in FEBE and that is going to bring us to the Firefox environment backup extension this is pretty cool, I've been using this for a couple of years but it does everything really quickly it's by Chuck Baker and it was last updated uh, the 23rd of February and it works on Firefox 3 so here we go, works with right down there so to install extensions into Firefox you usually click on this green button and it'll go ahead and install it uh, I already have FEBE, otherwise known as Phoebe already installed so I'm gonna hit cancel but you would hit install now uh, then to run it you go up to tools and there's FEBE and I'm gonna take you through the whole process of doing the backup and restoring so let's go to perform backup and depending on how you have things set up if this is your first time it's going to ask you to go ahead and set up a directory um, in this case this was an old directory I had it's not it's not um, valid anymore so I'm going to pick a new one by going to browse then we'll go here to uh, my computer and let's say I'm just going to put in eDrive and let's say I'm just going to create a new folder and I'm going to call it FEBE right there we go and hit OK and now that's my new directory that means in the lower right hand corner I can go ahead and close that notice uh, so for options I'm going to go back to the first tab here and it's really nice you can do a full profile to back up your extensions your themes uh, you can also say oh certain things don't back those up otherwise full profile is great another thing that Phoebe does is it allows you to schedule your backups I mean if you if you really feel the need to you can otherwise just go ahead and you know once a month or every couple of months back up your Firefox profile so in case it gets corrupted you can just go ahead and restore it uh, the other cool thing is you can connect it to box.net so you can actually uh, upload your backups there for safety alright so we are pretty much set to go so I'm hitting OK I'm gonna go here to tools and then I'm gonna say perform backup and since I selected the directory it knows where to put the stuff and there it goes, the backup is in progress and once the backup's done a new tab will open up in Firefox and it'll show you the results so I'm going to click on that and here it, it shows you know this one item was created here's the backup profile some stuff yada yada we don't really need to read okay so now here's the tr thing that people get stuck on in order to restore the profile you need to be in a different profile it's kinda like how a snake can't eat itself so you need to restore it you need to be in you need to restore it to a different new profile alright so let's go through that so here's what it would look like if I try to restore um, on top of the profile I'm in so I'm gonna go back to tools I'm gonna go to FEBE and restore and I'm gonna say restore profile and then it's going to ask me well, which one oh there's the one I just did and I'm going to get this uh, and they'll say oh do you want to do it maybe to the default profile see the current one is grayed out and in the lower right hand corner the message came up destination profile cannot be the current active profile alright so I'm going to show you how to create another profile while you're still in Firefox okay so we're going to close Firefox we'll just say quit and then we are going to open up a copy right here and we're right clicking and we're going into properties and on the first line at the top you want to add a dash P and that will prompt you for a profile each time you launch Firefox and that will be your opportunity to create one so we'll go here and I now can create a profile and I'll go through and I'll call this um, Adria June 2009 and now I can restore to this new profile so we'll do that in the next one 